was about to crash. Yep. This guy's here again. You know, you know how to drive, bro. Look at this. <laughs> hey, Jose. What's happening in today? Hey, what's going on, guys? We're back, or yeah, we're back. It's gonna, it's gonna go back on, guys. So oh, do they know? These are all the wrong clips. Yes. So they didn't sit on the Beamer well. But he got new ones. The straight from BMW, guys. Straight, straight from BMW. OEM clip. Look at it. They got little nipple tops on them. Oh yeah. Oh, you know why? Because they're not even sitting right. See how they're almost out? Yeah. Let's push this in. <laughs> Alright, let's see it now. Wait, hold on, you gotta line them up. Shove this in No! Now look at that feminine. No, oh gas. no gas. No gas, no gas, no gas, no gas. Guys, we did it! <laughs> Alright, guys, we have the dirtiest cars in Santa Ana right now, bro. Alright, it's almost today's video actually about. Alright, guys, come here. So, well, what so on my way, I went to go pick up an oil change. Mm -hmm. We got the best of the best oil. Video coming soon. While we were there, the homie, SoCal E36 parts in him up. But <laughs> I was there to pick up, and he actually decided to get rid of his E36. So he decided to hook it up, you know? Because as a fellow ex E36 guy, he's like, you know what? Keep these. Come here. That's all, that's all. What do we have here? We got some yellow fog lights. Wow. And they're going to look pretty spicy on this car, I think. I think they're going to look way better than the previous. Those are ultra rare, bro. Ultra rare. Ultra rare. Ultra rare fog lights going in the E36. For sure. So these are the ones that are on there currently. So regular old clear boys. Going into the yellow ones. I think they're going to look pretty hard with the black. Damn, bro, this is musty as hell. We're going to actually be watching these right after as well with a new thing we got or he got actually i got it for the channel first. all right how does one remove these fog lights Damn. so i think you just smack as hard as you can and it should pop out Maybe. we hope man we're still waiting on this guy's bumper to arrive look it's still not here so this guy was struggling for about thirty thousand minutes to take this off but all it took was a little smack it was five minutes dog all right, all right. so this old one depot is depot the old one. Yeah, it's out now. The yellow one. How did it go? Like this. It says it on the thingy thing. That's this side. It says right. What does it say? It's on this side. That's that side. Yeah. Wrong way, idiot. <laughs> Let's see right now. Yeah, buddy, this is good. Yeah, we need another lever for that side. Don't worry. Yeah, we're looking at it all. Hey, look at it already, bro. Mid, mm. mid, mid, mid. So, of course, on this channel, nothing goes to plan. This guy dropped the, was it the casing? Look at this housing, bro. This guy cannot install a light until he fixes. <laughs> so this is five minute install turned into two hours. Look at it. Bro, I mean, how long are this lights in at least? Looks cool. When in doubt, the zip ties will come out. Yes, yeah, sir. Well, these are these are BMW spec right here. Only BMW you guys use these ones. Yeah. Look at this. this guy is not holding. <laughs> yeah, we'll fix it when we get the new bumper. Oh yeah, we're waiting on a new bumper to get here. But for now, zip tie will work. Oh, shit. All right, zip tied up. Let's see if it goes in now. It went in. It went in. It went in. That's all we care about. Right? After 40 hours, the lights are on. Now, for the next segment of today's video, leave it in the comments which one you guys prefer. When we get the black bumper in, I think it will look 10 times better. Huh? Yeah. But right now it's temporary, and everything should be brand new with the new bumper, with the new lights, and it'll look fire. What do we have here today? Got a Ryobi pressure washer we bought, guys. We're gonna review Only this. Only a hundred dollars. Only a hundred dollars, so we're gonna test it out for you guys. I'll let you know if you guys should buy it. What comes in the box? We got a pressure washer. Pressure washer, baby phone canyon, the nozzle, right? Yep. And then the the gun. The gun. That's where you put the. Where do you put it? Oh, is we plug it in? You put the, wait, huh? Isn't this the one? The gun? I don't know. Oh, no, you, this is the extension. I don't even know. 
<laughs> All right, guys, we figured it out. I'm gonna try this thing out. Huh? Oh, shit. $100, $100 pressure washer. Will it work? Let's find out, I guess. Let's see. Well, Are you ceramic coated or what? Yeah. <laughs> hey, Dustin's coming right off that thing. <laughs> Your wrap's gonna bubble up. <laughs> that was like a lawnmower. <laughs> God damn, it's working pretty good, eh? I can't go further. Look at the little pressure washer that could right here. Look at all that pressure. <laughs> it looks pretty good, eh? Pretty good, guys. Well, we don't blew the seal right off this thing. <laughs> oh, plug your own. Hold it. <laughs> hold it there, hold it there. Stupid pressure. Hold on. It's gonna go. <laughs> <laughs> it's not working. No! <laughs> Turn, it Turn it off. Turn it off. Guys, nice. we're gonna try out this foam cannon by Ryobe. Turn that bit. <laughs> we got the cars all rinsed up. Now let's see how this works. Dude, are you sure that's how it goes? <laughs> I don't know. It's like the same thing as the hose. Take this off first. Alright guys, look. Some guy just pulled up on us. Michael, right? Michael, he just pulled up on us. He got a sick ass whip. Look at it. Bro, this makes me want a 240 so bad. It's like super clean. He just came through, bro. Super chill dude. Super sick. Yeah. He got some 370 stocks on it. That shit's super sick. Bro, leave in the comments, bro. Should we save up for a 240 for the channel? This thing's insanely clean, dude. It's like one of the cleanest. I've always seen him pass by the street and shit. We were just out here filming. You guys seen it. He just pulled up on us, bro. That shit's sick. His interior is super clean, too. He's going to manual swap it, too. So it's going to be even sicker. So, yeah, it's just super clean. Shout out to the homie. All right, guys. He's gone. He's gone. We had a good talk with him, but back to the video. Look at this foam cannon. It's think, good. Think you need more soap, dude. More soap? No, I think it's like this, to be honest. Hey, it's good coverage, at least. Uh, it's pretty good. Got some nice, nice bubbles. All right, guys, look at this coverage right now. Hey, lace mine up a little bit. What's up, man? Huh? Lace yourself up. <laughs> and just like that, with the black line drying towel, the Z is clean again. Look at these whips, guys. This is the result of an $100 pressure washer. Worth it? Yes. Ryobi, go and get it at Home Depot. I'm a, I think I'm going to do it one myself. Guys, I'm going to drop the link. I'm not sure. Drop it right here. Right here. Yeah. Well, look at it. They're back to looking fresh with just one wash. Show and it was front, like what five front. five minute wash. Let's show on the front. Let's show them the front. Also, let us know what you guys think of the yellow. Uh, ooh, look at that. But anywho, oh shit. What do you guys think of the yellow lights? With the black bumper, it's gonna look a lot better. Cause you know, all blacked out with the like, yellow lights. That's Batman. That's you. I'm sick. <laughs> Another plus of this little guy. It's tiny. Look at it. And it's pretty good amount of pressure. So and it has a little quick release thingies. Look at this guys. That's the pressure washer itself right there. That little tip. That's what creates the pressure. Yeah. But honestly, I say every one of y'all go buy it. If you just have a regular hose, go buy this pressure washer. It's pretty good. For the price range, can't get better than this, to be honest. Look at this clean interior. Oh my hey, god. From, right, like from 30 feet away, it looks good. Huh? Dude, guys. I might have the cleanest E3. <laughs> Leave in the comments if he has the cleanest E36 interior of all time. Let us know. Let us know. All right, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching another Clanny Scene video. The pressure washer was lit so go buy that and leave a like comment subscribe get us to 500 subs we're literally like 10 away from 500. look at this guy let him know like subscribe and uh buy this pressure washer thank you guys <laughs> as we're almost at 500 subscribers please get us to 500 subscribers so we can drop that 500 special we just yeah. want to drop it that's why well, we're almost there bro we're almost there but yeah guys thank you guys so much for all the support on all these cars all the videos thank you guys and we'll catch you on the next one